We have two guests joining us this afternoon, all the way from Dublin. First up, we have Malik, who is a Nigerian Irish musician whose style of wordplay and lyricism has interwoven a mental visual explosion of life from his experiences as a young African. We also have Travis, who is a Nigerian born Dublin based creative artist, initially a model. He has been working and perfecting his craft within the music and fashion industry. Ladies and gentlemen, Malik is in the building, and of course, Travis is also in the building. Yeah, we love for having us. Appreciate yes, you Thank you for coming through. Yeah, no. Travis, is, is that your real name? Or because, no, has anybody told you that you look like Travis Scott? No. Travis Scott? I hear that one every time. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. I hear that one every time. Okay. But my real name is Luke Man. Okay, Luke Man. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So thank you guys for joining us. Um, what's up with you, music wise? First of all, I'm just going to say, nine years before I've been in Nigeria, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Like here, music wise, it's, it's good because, like, as in the art history, my history is African heritage. My energy is that, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. In Dublin, like, as in showcasing that is always important for me, you know? Sure. To let the people sure. feel like, as in, I know where I'm from, you yeah, know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, yeah. Okay. So, yeah, that would be my issue. Okay. Sure. And the fact that we can, come, we can come to, like, the country as well and still continue to do music mm -hmm. and, like, show people over here mm -hmm. what we're doing in... Because mm -hmm. we're still the Nigerian diaspora. <laughs> and we're, so we're, just, we're just turning up over there in Ireland, you know what I mean? But at the end of the day, everything comes back here, so... Okay, how, how is it like doing music there, by the way? Uh, I know everybody, Afrobeats are sticking over right now, but yeah, yeah, Afrobeats, how is it? Yeah. How is it? It's, 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 it's cool. I feel like in Dublin, it's more so they're still a bit behind in the time, mm -hmm. but they didn't know they needed something like this until we came in, do you know what I mean? So when we came in and then we started making music, at the start, it was slow because some people just didn't want to really take it in. But now it's past the level that they have to take have it. To we've, made enough, I mean, we've made enough noise that, like, they just have to, they just see that you can't escape anymore. Actually you know? speak, so, you know? Mm -hmm. like Actually as speak in, louder, so. And any difficulty for you? Uh, there's barriers for sure, like, as mm -hmm. in the barriers would be, like, that culture gap that like, you're bridging. Yeah. Yeah. But that's the fun. That's what you're yeah, here to do, yeah. you know? Mm -hmm. You can't complain, because, like, you see that challenge and you know, like, as in, there's going to be longevity in this game. Okay. You know what I mean? And, like, as in, since we started, like, as in, to see the young Irish youth receive us. Like, I'm African, bro. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm in Europe doing what I'm doing, and, like, they're yeah. receiving us. Like, do do like, boys. It's, it's, it's something. Do do boys. You so, know? So, so, do, do you get to add a little bit of the African influence, like, languages into any of your songs? Well, everybody should come and teach me Yoruba. I hear it fluently. I can hear it, but. I can speak it, Jeje. Like, yeah, as in, yeah, I should take my time. Yeah. Okay. I should take my time. Yeah, okay. But respectfully, I'm going to make sure, like, as in, because yeah, yeah, yeah. I throw in, in now and then okay. but more time we, like, we're starting you know we haven't given out our full discography okay. like we got we got we got tracks mm -hmm. like, mm -hmm. why did them Travis what about you inf infusing the lingua of course I, I'm, so I'm dropping a I'm dropping a project towards the end of the year we actually me and my so I make music with one of my boys his name's Els okay. he's not here shout out Elo shout out Elo come on <laughs> you're really but um, we're dropping a project at the end of the year I actually have one song called Homelander I might call it Naja Boys but <laughs> we'll see but like that, that song I want to like infuse a lot of like where I'm from okay. culturally in Nigeria all that kind of stuff so I it's think coming it's coming it's funny dude like cause like you could think like you could take a Nigerian anywhere in this world and they won't, in their blood, that thing won't kick for them. You're yeah, Nigerian no matter where you go, bro. It's the blood, it's the hustle. The blood. <laughs> it's the I got to have some more blood in my new like, <laughs> Now, let, 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 why, why, why music for you, Malik? So I'm actually a businessman, first mm -hmm. and foremost. Yeah. I'm not going to lie. Like, as in, it started for me, music came at a time where, you know, I had to know identity. I had to know self. Like, it wasn't, it wasn't actually like I chose music. Mm -hmm. Like, funny enough, I remember like when I was in school, like, there was a music exam. I put my name on the thing. I give the guy people, say, hey, how can you make money off music? Take it, yo. Oh, wow. Like, yeah. you know? And then a period of time in life where I needed to understand my emotions. I needed to question a few things because I could have just been Irish. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I need to find home, you know? I know what that is. And I pen my feelings down. And it came out as a song, bro. Mm -hmm. That's when it started for me, bro. Yeah, yeah. I ain't, I never looked back. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And, and Travis, I heard because of COVID, yeah, yeah. Break so that down for us. It was during, so during lockdown, um, I've always, so I used to do poetry. That was my thing. Oh. And then, obviously, finding ways to express myself is like, that's, that's my bag. That's like what I love to do the most. So during COVID, we were just indoors all the time. I don't even know if there was COVID out here. You guys were just living your life. Nice. We, we were on lockdown too. Oh, for real? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> In, 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 in Ireland, we were locked away for like two years, couldn't leave the crib. Like, two? Yeah, two they years. They tried straight. it. We shot, we shot a music video mid COVID. The feds, like, all the police came to a location. We had all our mates, everybody come. Yeah, was this yeah. when we started making yeah. music. Yeah, yeah. Like, so everything was meant to be quiet. Well, and we were still where? making noise. Yeah. Like, but yeah, we were there for yeah. time, so it was like, that's where then I 
because of all the time I had, I was yeah. like, you know what, let me actually take this music thing seriously. Yeah. And everything just kind of fell into place. You know what I mean, my friends would tell me, yo, oh boy, yeah, it's awful. <laughs> <laughs> and, and then I, I, I took them in, and then now we're here, so yeah. thank God. And we do a lot more of the music too, yeah? Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Modeling for Fashion, Trevor's. Modeling. Yeah, I own a sure. brand as well called Gliders, yeah. so that's like, we're, we're kind of like, because we're first generation Irish, Nigerian, black, Nigerian, Irish, Irish, Nigerian, so like, we're, we're creating culture, do you know what I mean? So like, we're paving the way from the young youth behind yes. us. Yes. So they don't have to get lost in that thing, yeah? yeah, yeah they yeah, can sure. keep their identity strong and they can know who they are and where they're from. Yeah, sure. very valid. Who, who, who are the Nigerian artists that you guys tend to look up to or you listen to their work? I, I, I can, if I can turn, I point at that photo and say, oh. fella, for sure. Oh. <laughs> because yeah. Everybody fella. Obviously, yeah. you know, but I, like... These new guys, Odumodu Black. Odumodu yeah, Black? Yeah, Odumodu Black is crazy. He's, he's, mm -hmm. he's turning yeah, yeah, up. Nice. Um, and then obviously Naramali, I like Naramali. He's just oh. his swag is. <laughs> okay, Naramali is kind of like in a situation right now. Okay, don't yeah. mind me. Oh, oh, <laughs> no, 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 nothing. nothing. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, obviously, that guy. Wiz the kid. situations he's been in, who handled them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. get through sure. it. Get Wiz through. kid, Wiz kid, uh, David O. David O's uh, all of them. Um, and then. Um, What's his name? Rema. Rema's going Rema, crazy right yeah. now. I like all of them. All what, of them. What's your take about this dominance right now as it's, regards Afrobeats to the world? Come anywhere in Europe, all you're going to hear is Afrobeats. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come anywhere. anywhere. You're, not gonna, you're not actually going to hear anything else. Like, yeah, yeah. I, like, there was a time I used to work in a retail store, and back in the day, I, I'd be writing my bars as I'm listening to Taylor Swift. Do you know what I mean? Because that's all they used to play, all their, you know, their own music and now that. It's different. Now it's different, different bro. Different. Like, as in, like, I'm, I'm, I'm stepping eating. to places that, like, I know, like, as in, for a man like me to enter, it's techie. Yeah. Now I'm to from outside the place and they're already playing my music. I'm stepping with confidence now. You hear me? I'm not feeling any sort of way. Like yeah, yeah. Africa stand up, we're here. You hear yeah, me? Yeah, really yeah. Travis, what about you? Nah. How do you feel about the dominance already? Nah, I, I agree with him. I think it's amazing because the 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 older generation that might have overlooked it, their sons and daughters are running in saying, I wanna be live. Yeah, true. <laughs> so, so it's nice. It is nice. And yeah. it gives it it gives us that more like level of empowerment too, do you know what I mean? They're like, you know, it, what you doing? can't stop this, do you know what I mean? You can't stop it. Now let's talk about what are you guys doing in Nigeria? You said nine years you haven't been in Nigeria. What about you, Travis? Same time. Same time. Yes. Why are you guys in Nigeria? <laughs> to take our girls? Yeah. <laughs> right. Right. We, can, we can break a few things in. Like, <laughs> But to see family, okay. to bring this Irish Nigerian link up in. We were in the studio yesterday with yeah, a few yeah, artists, yeah. a few oh, Nigerian really artists. Nice, yeah, man, yeah. nah, it was nice, as in, like, like as in, because obviously we all knew everyone speaks English in Nigeria. <laughs> everyone speaks more, more, everything, you know? And we pick it together because we're a very diverse country, like, as in. And to see the fact that, like, as in, anywhere Nigerian is, and you see another Nigerian, you know what, we can, we can get it. Represent. Represent. Mm -hmm. So, like, as in building that, building that bridge between Ireland and Nigeria and even more Europe, you get me? The UK, everything, and being a part of that is, is why we're here, like. Yeah, yeah, so. Yeah. so what should we expect from you, Travis? Uh, projects, anyone out? I'm dropping, I'm dropping a project, hopefully the end of the year, if okay. don't quote me. If not, then January. <laughs> it's called Doghouse, so the last... Doghouse? Doghouse, yeah. Why? So it's just, like, it's to implement that. So my first project... Um, call Full Circle. I dropped it in January and we were aiming for that number one. Ended up getting number two, but still is number Ooh. one in the streets because we're 12 sales away from beating Taylor Swift as well. Uh -huh. Beat a lot of other That's people. massive. Then no, huge. But then this one, we're coming for that number one spot for sure. Man, get it. Let's go. Well, it's Let's called go. Doghouse and it kind of emulates the like energy of like really just locking into your craft, okay. do you know what I mean? And like focus on that, that creative process, but at the same time, life is struggle, but don't oh, hone in you. on the struggle. Do you know what I mean? The struggle, like, struggle is a part. Struggle life, is what you right? have to do. To, the solution is beside the struggle. That's, that's what my uncle was saying. You find, that's why you find the diamond. Yeah, you know what I mean? So that's you gotta, you gotta keep pushing. You have to run towards that thing. Okay, what about you, Malik? Any projects? So? Spiritual warfare. Hmm? Spiritual warfare. Spiritual yeah. warfare. <laughs> yeah, you have like that. Yeah. 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 So yeah. Why? That's we war. Yeah. So that's uh, the tape I dropped two months ago. Uh, okay. The art of war. Cause this is the thing for me. It's been a, it's been a, identity is a huge thing. Like as in, the, like the African you in the diaspora, it's easy for you to lose yourself. You yeah, know, yeah. I forget your heritage and like as in, cause obviously like there's for long there's been an image of Africans. You know, mm -hmm. but that image ain't real. I'm home now and I see that. Yeah, that yeah. image is not real. And I want anyone who's watching this to understand that come back here, like, Yo, it's lit, Swiftly. Ninja, it's lit. Uh, I, I guess some people will not want to come back or some yeah. want to go. <laughs> yeah. But that's all right, that's all right. Yeah. So that's tape, right. I'm dropping another tape in 10th ten to the 10th, hold okay. me on that, so Okay, any, 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 any collaboration we should look out for? Say again? With popular guys, any, any collaboration Ooh, we should look out for? There's a few things coming. Ooh, so was that guy? 
Okay. The L's, Fires. these are the Irish I oh, okay. who are like okay. big, yeah. like oh, as okay. in I'm, I'm broken, like me boundaries. Shout out the boys back home, man. Manjola, Keanu the pilot, <laughs> Alexander yeah. Holland. Yeah. Now we've got a few guys, we've got okay. a few guys, many okay. guys, yeah. Okay. We'll definitely look out for that. How can fans reach out to you on social so, media? On Instagram, it's Travis in it, and then the brand, so Travis in it, T R A V I S I N I H, and then our brand is called Gliders. So on Instagram, that's Gliders, G L I D E R S B B B. Gliders B. And then, come on. TikTok, Cellular Bandit. I'm not going to spell that one out. Yeah. <laughs> Yes, yes. Instagram is probably the main one, so yeah. just tap in and then yeah, see what's up. Okay, what about you, Malik? They call me Malik the Melanated Militant. She get me. Yeah, so yeah. Melanated Militant is my Instagram handle. Mm -hmm. Like if anything, anything, anytime you come to me, it's always going back to Africa. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I mean? Like it's always going back That's to Africa. Real. Not forgetting the roots. Not nah, all. I can't. I can't. Yeah. I can't. All right. That's what's kept me strong. Like as in. Yeah. Is there another thing you guys would like to share? Yeah, we we turning up, man. Doghouse soon. You man, you, you man. That project coming. Yeah, hey, yeah, yeah, hey, yeah, everyone plug back in. home, man. What's up? Come on. <laughs> All right. Thank you guys for coming through. And of course, Bro. we wish you the very best yeah, right here you. in Nigeria. Yeah. yeah. One, one, one thing quickly. Okay. Sure. So we do more than yes. uh, music. Yeah. My mom's got a family food business. Oh, okay. In Ireland, we've been selling Nigerian food. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. She's the first Nigerian lady to bring like. Bring it to this, you know, like shop, price. right? Yeah. So we got super value. Super value. Uh, we package the food, like, as in, and we, we've had it in there. Like, we've been tasting the taste buds of the Irish community. <laughs> yeah. you know what I mean, like. Very necessary. <laughs> very necessary. Very bro. Thank you. Thank you very much, Thanks guys, for coming man. through. And of course, yeah. we wish you the very best in Nigeria and, of course, music wise.